Hi everyone, and welcome to this week's book review. This week's book review is for Maxwell Maltz, Psycho-Cybernetics. Now this is a book I read a few months back, and it stayed with me because it was all about your brain. And as a student of psychology, I realized that your brain is one of the most important organs probably the most important organs if we're being real here. But psychocybernetics, it takes psychology, right? The psycho part. And it takes it a step further. So not only how you can use your brain to actually make a difference in your life and what you do in the lives of others, but also how you can tweak your mind, tweak your brain, tweak your thoughts, to actually get the result that you want. Now, I know there's a lot of, you know, hush, hush, wish, wash, confusion about the word tweak. We don't like tweaking, right? In some cultures, tweaking means changing something you're not supposed to. But when it comes to your brain, if you have a vision and an ambition, then tweaking it may just be for the better, not only for you, but for others around you. And when that happens, it's very difficult to say no to that. It's almost an endeavor that you need to do. Right? I call it the worthy endeavor. So psycho-cybernetics, what it does is basically shows you how you can do these things, either with sh mindset strategies, right? learning how to learn. And I want to talk a little bit about the second part of the word right? in the title, cybernetics. So cybernetics, that's um, actually from information science where you would have these different, um, you know, nodes and we had the, these different, um, you know, programs in physical form, right, that you would use to create a computer, right? And the computer would create software and then the software would be basically what you see when you open your computer or your phone. So it's based on that science, seeing you know, the brain as a system, a connection of nodes, of cells that work together to create thoughts, ideas, and um, generate whatever you want, right? Creation, create different things. Create, um, you know, just like this, making a video, but you can also use it in your everyday life with relationships, you know, getting better at work, um, getting getting better, you know, sleep, feeling better about yourself. That's really the science behind making all that things, all those things happen. So if you want to pick up the book, as usual, there's going to be a link around this video. You can click it and then get the book yourself. Um, but other than that, that's really all I wanted to say about this book. You know, I don't want to reveal too much. It's really what will explain everything. Um, the author probably knows what he's talking about. Um, you can even research Maxwell Moss if you want. Um, not that like I'm giving you permission, you know, I just think it's a good idea. So if you like this video, don't hesitate to let me know with a like or a comment. And if you want more videos like this, don't hesitate to subscribe or like wherever you're watching this. Okay, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.